time now for all the news from the ICC Cricket World Cup. Well, in news from the fourth and final quarter final, Sri Lanka have thrashed the English to go into the semi finals without losing a single wicket. Dilshan and Taranga set an emphatic seal on Sri Lanka's place in their home semi final against New Zealand next Tuesday as England's chaotic World Cup campaign came to an abrupt end and anticlimactic one as well under the floodlights in Colombo. Setting a testing total of 238 at a venue where successful run chases have been notoriously thin on ground, Sri Lanka's openers set about proving that history is bunk as they sauntered to victory by 10 wickets and with a massive 64 balls to spare. And while India will battle it out with arch-rivals Pakistan in the semi-final in Mohali in the coming week, there will be cricket diplomacy that will play out in the VIP stands. After Prime Minister Manmohan Singh yesterday wrote individually to both Pakistan President Zardari and Prime Minister Gilani, inviting them to watch the big match on Wednesday, Zardari and Gilani are meeting to decide on India's invite. And on to some news from the uh, circle of entertainment. While well, Bachchan Jr. has an action packed year ahead of him, he is all set to produce his next film, Buddha, opposite wife Aishwarya Rai Bachchan. Pooja Talwar caught up with him. Well, if there's someone who's really in the mood to play games, is Abhishek Button. So what's the game plan and are you fair game for it? Oh, um, yes, the game plan. Yeah, the game begins on the 1st of April, which is the day of the release of the film. And uh, looking forward to it. It's, um, it's my first ever murder mystery. Uh, I've never acted in a murder mystery. I've been looking to... I, I enjoy watching murder mysteries. Mm -hmm. And um, the film is shaped up nicely. So the game plan is hopefully to get as many people into the theatre as possible. And if one sees your roster for this year, you're really putting the act into action. Like you've got Dam Marudam, you've yeah. got Dhoom 3, there's of course games. So was it intentional to just do action-oriented films? Um, no, actually, game is, I mean, game, like I said, is a murder mystery. Dam Marudam is, is an action thriller and Players is a heist film. Um, so no, I think it just uh, so happened like that. You know, I don't think it, uh, there was any plan to specifically only do action or just do comedy. And also you'll be working with Amir, so have you managed to pull Mr. Perfectionist's legs off as yet? No, I haven't started <laughs> shooting for the film. We only start in December, so we have a long time. Uh, they're still, uh, I think, locking in the script and doing the pre-production, so we haven't started shooting it. But I'm looking forward to working with him. Uh, I admire him very much as an artist and uh, uh, very, very excited to be working with him. And, and uh, Uday and I are very excited to welcome him to the Doom Gang. <laughs> and also, National Award winner for your... Uh, production part and are you going to start another one yes we started our ab corps next production two weeks ago it's called buddha and um, it should release by june july who's the buddha in it um uh, the main lead of the film is my father <laughs> <laughs> um but uh, we're very very excited about the film buddha is um is a script which i really enjoyed reading it's an out and out commercial action film and uh, it, it'll be good to bring the angry young man back from the 70s and into 2011. When do we see you romancing your wife on screen? Uh, hopefully soon, hopefully soon. There are a few scripts that are out there which um, we're reviewing right now, but hopefully soon, yes. With that, we wrap this bulletin. Thanks so much for watching the Late Night News. Good night.